Your attorney tells you that your case is settled, so now what? Well, this can go a lot of different ways, but let me give you some basic things to think about. Once the case is settled, what that means is we have reached an agreement with the, either the insurance company on the other side or their lawyer to pay you a certain amount of money. Our job generally when we get there is we want to put as much of that money in your pocket as we can and there are a lot of things that affect that. One thing is if, if you have outstanding unpaid medical bills, then we're trying to find out how much money is owed to all of those uh, medical providers, whether it's a doctor or hospital, and often we're trying to get those places to take less money, get reductions, because any money they knock off of their bill is money that will uh, put more money in your pocket. And likewise, you may have had health insurance companies or Medicare or Medicaid pay your medical bills. Well, if they have, then they have a legal right to get some of their money back out of your settlement. So one of the things we'll do after your case is settled is try to get agreements from any health insurance companies, Medicare or Medicaid, to reduce their claim as much as we can because everything we don't have to pay to them is money that you get to keep. So once your case is settled, there still is quite a bit of work in many cases to figure out how much money can we keep for you. You need to talk to your lawyer and the legal assistant about that. They can tell you where we stand in that. We're generally trying to go as quickly as we can, but often there are rules with Medicare, Medicaid, and health insurance that will limit how fast we can go. Just be assured we're going as fast as we can because until you get your money, then we don't get paid either. Thank you. Have a good day.